We're gonna be gluing our totem poles to this base um, just because they're a little topsy-turvy. We don't want them to fall over. So this is actually gonna be where you sign your work. Down in the lower left-hand corner, I want you to write your name. And down here in the lower right-hand corner, you need to write your class. Snap that cap, give it a nap. You can put that to the side. And that's what your animals look like after you have drawn, colored, and cut them out. We're gonna be gluing the animals right onto the pole. And the first thing you need to think about is where you want the animals to go. And then make sure that you have enough room for all of them. Like the monkey, um, he's gonna take up more than one of the rolls. So what I might have to do is either overlap the frog on top of his feet, or see if by putting the owl up a little further, if I can move the frog up. So kind of see where they're gonna go. If you have a winged animal, they were usually towards the top of the pole. What we're gonna be doing is using Elmer's glue. Remember to untwist the top and we give it one, two, three shakes upside down. We're not gonna put the glue on the animal. We're gonna actually put it on the totem pole itself. So simply give it a little zigzag. Put your animal on your pole. And if you get a little bit too much glue, that's okay, it will dry clear. You can also use a napkin and just kind of blot it off. When you put the animals on, you do need to hold them for 30 seconds, so you can sit and hold it and count to 30 slowly in your head. In the case of my monkey, he has some feet sticking up, so what I would do for those is just give it one dot of glue, and again, hold that for 30 seconds before you go on to do the other paws. If parts of your animals don't want to stay down, like I'm having a hard time keeping the feet down, just raise your hand and let me know. We can put a rubber band around it while it dries. The last step of our project is to glue it to our base. What we're gonna do is put a ring of glue right around the bottom, just like that, working kind of quickly. Put it in the middle of the base. Make sure it has a nice ring around the bottom. If it doesn't, you can add a little bit more, just like that. When you're finished with the glue, twist it closed, clean off the tip. Artist, that is a finished totem pole created by inspiration of the Haida Native Americans. Good job today, artists.